Here we go. <coughs> right, television. TV. Television. TV. Four words. Four words. First, first word. word. First word. I can't Dead. 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 Oh, Dead. Tapping. Uh, hanging. Hanging. Um, Viradux. Um, um, Braille. Uh, um, red. 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 Thick. Stupid. Man. Effeminate. Husband. Husband. Annoying. Idiot. Father? Disappointment. Shame. D uh, regret. Profession. Um, lazy. Doctor. Sadness. Doctor. Do thank you. Doctor. Doctor is not Foot the doctors. first thing you do when you look Four at words. him. Four words. Four Doctor Jacob is died. Quick, 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 quick. Go. Minute. Go. 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 Second word. Second word. Sounds like. Sounds like. Nah. Fit. Uh, Sexy. Hey, hi, guys. Hi. Hello. Thanks for chatting to Cosmo. Hello. In my cinema, there were so many guys in the film belly laughing. What do you think it is that makes this film so good for men? I think the humour is, um, it's raunchy. Like, it's not yeah. particularly um, geared just for women. I think the laughs are really um, big and um, it's an important thing because I think with romantic comedies always it's like, well, I'll go with my girlfriend or, you know, when it's yeah. my girlfriend will tell me to see it. But it's really... Not the case. Like it's a, it's a very. I think it appeals film. to both sexes. Yeah, and I think um, uh, it's a film for everyone. Whereas mm. you, you like you, the cliche of romantic comedies is, is that they're solely for women. Mm. And as you say, guys get dragged along. But I think it's um, funny and romantic, mm. yeah. which is kind of the objective of a romantic comedy. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> one of my favourite scenes was the one with the doves. How was that? And was it really scary? And how many takes did that go right? I didn't realise how hijacked I would be by my physical fear of the dove because the scene was not written that. Nat is terrified of doves, mm. <laughs> it's quite, but it ended up a little bit like that. And the first half of the day, we, it took a day to do it, and the first half of the day was unusable because I was just on the floor, <laughs> literally, like, you know, in fear of the animal. Uh, and then it got better. It got better, but it took a while. And Simon Baker, on the other hand, didn't flinch. Cool so he was just so yeah. mellow and had, at one point, two doves on his head. <laughs> And didn't, didn't even you know, move. This was it like made him a better actor. Yeah. He's a cool <laughs> yeah. So have you had any oh my god cringe moments with like the in laws? Have uh, you? Um, I th I probably have over the years. I mean, you know, certain times. Um, but I guess I'm always uh, I'm the type of person who's very you know aware of yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. everything. Yeah, I think yeah. always on your yeah. best behaviour. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Um, Me too. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that's good. Mm. In the film, you um, you look amazing. Like you're like oh, the, um, you. the clothes that you wear look fab in the film, um, and obviously you look great on the red carpets as well all the time. Oh. And today, <laughs> um, are you like a major fashion? Thank lover? you. I do. I've always loved um, cl clothes. I have, you know, since I was um, little. Just enjoyed dressing up in my mum's clothes and all this sort of thing. So yeah, it's it's um it is a you know fun, silly part of the job that you get to. You know, access to she's a fashion icon. things like that. She I is. would. She's that a fashion not icon. True. She is. She is, isn't she? <laughs> she's a, she's a tastemaker. Loves it. Are you going to ask me the question about fashion? <laughs> yep. <that can> be. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I've got. I've got <laughs> so I think that the Cosmo girls can probably really relate to having to pick between two men. Um, so have either of you been in that? Uh, not to pick in two, between have two I men. Chosen <laughs> between two. No, I've chosen between two. Two girls before in the past, you know. Of course, I am. Oh, yeah. look at you! <laughs> yeah, I'm, just, I'm just a bloke. Yeah. Uh, have two? you chosen between two men? Um, two or three. Two, two or three. three. Two or three. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, Rafe, you've gone through like quite a transformation for the film. It's all oh, like, everyone's talking about everyone. it, aren't they? But you're so everyone's talking about it. Of talking about it. Um, <laughs> but, <laughs> what did you miss the most? Because I heard that you gave up dairy, sugar, and wheat. What else is there? Yeah, what, yeah. Do you know what yeah. I mean, what does that leave you with? <laughs> what did you miss? Oh, I missed everything. everything. Yeah, oh yeah, everything. I, like, food is a very important part of my life, and I love to eat. It's one of the things that makes me happy to be alive. So, um, to not be able to eat all the things that I love was a real pain. I'll just say a couple of celebs um, couples, and you yeah. just need to tell me whether you give it a year or is it everlasting love. Okay. okay. So, first one, Katy Perry and John Mayer. I would... Everlasting love. Yes. Katie Price and husband number three. Give it a year. <laughs> Rihanna and Chris Brown. No comment. Mm, pass. <laughs> and Kim and Kanye. Everlasting love. Everlasting love. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I was over sex. And then someone shows you a Justin Bieber video. And all you can then think about is that. Isn't he like 15? Oh, he'd know what to do. I'd ruin Bieber. 
a list of pros and cons of Nat. Pros, body. I've seen it nude, loved it. I, I beg your pardon, when have you seen it nude? Walked in oh. when she was getting changed. What do you mean you walked in when she... Accidentally. What's that? What's that?